Hey there, this is Cody Nokolo, here with another one of my translations of Sakurai's Famitsu columns. If you'd like to source this video, please remember to credit me as this article's translator. This week's column, number 627, is about maintaining Famicom accessories. Sakurai begins by mentioning a video he was in on Washagaya TV's YouTube channel. When Sakurai mentioned in his March 26th tweet that he presented his Rob somewhere, that video is what he was talking about. You can check that out by following the link to it in the description. Sakurai first mentions which two accessories he'll be focusing on, the Famicom's Rob and Family Basic, which both released around 36 to 37 years ago. He says that when Smash Bros. Brawl was being developed, the Rob accessory was used as a model to create the fighter version of Rob. Sakurai explains that when Brawl was being made, it was a while after Rob had been available. Now the white parts of his Rob had changed to yellow. After a long time, the whites on a Famicom system completely changed to a bright yellow color. It's a difficult thing to fix. He mentions that for some reason, the arm support part of his Rob stayed white, but the head turned yellow, so now it looks like Rob has a farmer's tan from wearing a t-shirt and shorts. Sakurai had to disassemble his Rob before he could repair anything on it. He removed its logo sticker by heating it up with a hairdryer. Then he used bleach to restore the discolored parts. It was pretty simple to reassemble afterwards since the middle chassis connects everything. He says that whoever designed it that way is great. But after just a week, his Rob had already turned a little yellow again. He wanted to preserve the original colors, so instead, he painted it. Next, he did his Family Basic, which has the same white parts as the Famicom. He thinks the end result for this one came out very nice. To paint the basic, he found a big cardboard box, took the basic apart, left all the other parts behind, then lightly sprayed the outer shell with white spray paint out on his veranda. Sakurai ends the column by saying it's important to do this kind of maintenance once in a while, but for his kind of situation, it's difficult to do these kinds of things all the time. Thanks for watching. If you enjoyed this video, leave it a like and subscribe for more. You can also back us on Patreon through the link in the description. Thanks to all of our patrons for their support. This has been Cody Nokolo signing off, and always remember to return to the source.